Hey guys and gals, I'm Pal, and welcome back to The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Last time, we traveled through one of the most interesting takes of the Lost Woods yet. It had the very similar uh, listening or looking for the right path trial that is present in almost every iteration of the Lost Woods, but it did so in a way that felt new. It felt fresh. And I absolutely loved how they went about doing that. This episode, I'm going to be buying out everything they have. I'll take them all. Yeah, I, I know it costs a lot, but I'm going to be buying them all. Especially the rush rooms, because those are needed for not only quest later in the game, as people have told me, but also for upgrading my climbing gear, which I am all about. So I'm going to be buying all of this. And then I'm going to be undertaking the trials that they had made note of. It looks like we're going to be spe spending a little bit longer in the the Lost Woods than I originally I I had expected. I expected that we would just come here, maybe get a couple shrines, maybe find some some cool secrets. Really, one apple. Uh, I don't need the rice. I don't need the sugar. I can get that elsewhere. I can get the arrows. That arrows are always good. And that's, that's how many of them? Yeah, that's, I now have a lot. And shock arrows, those are kind of hard to, wait a minute. Why can't I buy this? Why, why couldn't, there we go. That was odd. Yeah, uh, mm, how many is it? Five? Yeah, I'll buy it. That's a, it's a lot of money, but I now have 17 shock arrows, so I'm set for a long time. So yeah, this episode we're going to be exploring the Korok Forest, and it starts with, you know what, it starts with us talking to some of these Koroks. While we have seen Koroks all game, none of them said, have said any more than, oh man, you found me. Bye. <laughs> and so now we can talk to some that have some inkling of intelligence. It's, it's, it's Mr. Hero. Yay, Mr. Hero came to visit us in the forest. What took you so long? Peek's... Peeks thought of a trial that would make Mr. Hero stronger. You won't have to fight, and it's not scary. But you'll need to be extra careful. I want to sell a bloopy. Or see a bloopy. It's a blue, glowy, hoppy thing that glows in the dark. Just about peak size. I really just want to see a bloopy. Even just a picture of one. Uh, I know exactly where I can find one of those, so I will undertake this quest. I won't tackle it right now, but I know exactly where I can find one. There's a shrine... Well, actually... The shrine that we needed to complete all the qu the uh, side quests around the town of Kakariko Village in order to unearth that shrine, there is a bloopy right next to it that appears pretty much every time you warp there. So I can I can get a picture of one of those. That'd be pretty easy. So I can do that. Uh, you just do the bed. You, these are just shopkeeps. So that's a pretty easy quest, which I know exactly how to tackle. There was... let's see. There's him, I guess. But there's also a sh Oh, hello. There's a shrine right over that way. And there's also... Haystu. And Haystu is someone I've been looking for for a long time. We... they... they upgrade... she upgrades... I, she, he... she... I don't know. She upgrades our inventory slots and we've seen her like three times. And then she just disappeared. I'm impressed you found your way through the Lost Woods and made it here. So have you brought me any Korok Seeds? I sure hope so. If you return my Lost Korok Seeds to me, I'll expand the size of your inventory. Which stash do you want another slot in? Weapons, you know it. You just need five? I'll, I can do that. And I'm going to skip this out because you've seen this before. So, so then a den den, you want to expand another stash? Uh, not right now. I will save my five seeds for upgrading my weapon stash again, which will take 12 seeds to upgrade. I gave two more slots towards my weapons, two more for bows, and two more for shields. But I would like to give a special emphasis for my my weapons, since I get I get and use weapons more than I do anything else. So, let's enter the cow- the Q- Kyo? Kyo? Kyo. Rouge Shrine, and get things started off. 
Fateful Stars. I only need... Ooh, this appears to be one of the memorization ones. I only need three more spirit orbs. At that point, then I can upgrade my, my hearts one more time, and that's all I need to be able to pull the Master Sword. Unless people were saying you need 13 hearts to spend to get it. In which case, I might need two more. Look at the, look to the stars for guidance. The constellations are the key. Oh boy. Oh boy. So there actually is something at the very top of the tree, but I'm ignoring it for now because I need to look at the stars. So I need to go as high up as possible. Which appears to be this. I'm even... I'm actually cold because of it. Wow. Stars. There are no stars. Because of course there's a blood moon. Or is there really a blood moon? No, that's... Huh. It says consult the stars. Here, one moment. Let's... Let's check out what's at the top of the tree. There's a dude here. And sunset fireflies. Who are you? Hmm? Ugh, I was having such a nice dream. Wait, if you're here, does this mean you want to face the ultimate trial? Oh, I, I said I'll try it. Oh, no. If I'll... S I'll tell you a riddle about an object. Your job is to solve the riddle and bring me the correct objects. Here comes your first riddle. Small, red, round, and sweet. Bring me one of this simple treat. That's... that's an apple. Yeah, have you figured it out? I'm guessing you're more stumped than the base of a felled tree. If you place the right object on the leaf, I'll dance for you. Uh, that seems really easy. Apple? I bought... I bought an apple. So, hold. And throw. Apple! It's an apple! That's it! That's it! You got it! Ahem. The next riddle is... Kakariko Village's specialty fruit. Its rock-hard flesh is quite resolute. I love these rhymes. So, that's easy. It's the, uh, the fortified pumpkin. So, sort inventory. I actually do have two of these. Hello! Fortified pumpkin! That's it! That's it! You got it! Ahem. The next riddle is... This sultry shroom will warm your bones. It makes its home in warmer zones. I don't think I have this, but we'll see. Never mind. I do, I think. I, th I think this is it. Sun shroom! That's it, that's it! You got it! And <clears throat> Next rule is... Its scales and tail will zap you, no doubt. This shocking swimmer is called... A, a, a fish. That's a zap fish, which I don't think I have, but I know where to buy it. Yeah, I don't have that, but I'm fairly certain I can buy that in in the uh, Zora's Domain. So I'll deal with that later, but I, I did want to visit this. So the constellation puzzle will have me stumped for a while because I can't see the stupid stars. So wait a minute. Constellation. Is it this? Wait a minute. No, I got it. I got it. Okay. So there are three stars in that one. So th three. And there are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Wait, there's seven. Uh, you know, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Just hear me out. Hear me out. So we do that. Okay, that, 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 that cake don't bake. Uh, one, two, three, there, there are ten. But the problem is, with that, is that the other side has an ast- It has an astronomical amount of stars on it. But I'm pretty sure these stars are the key, not the ones in the night sky. There are stars there. Look to the stars for guidance. The constellations are the key. I, I also, I can't believe I was as dim-witted as to go outside and try to look at the stars. Uh, forget I, forget I did that. Is, is this a key? I mean, by, I mean by that, a map key. So, 
are we counting the number of this constellation right here that appears on that wall? Could that be it? In which case there are one, two, regardless of orientation, by the way. So they, it could be upside down and still count. One, two, three, four, five. There are five there. That's a number that adds up to five, and five is the maximum that we can answer here. So we can do that. How many of this weird one are here? It's an L and an S. So L, S. There's one. Okay, so starting from the top, that's not one. That's not one. That's definitely not one. L, S, L, S, L, S. There are three. So that's still falling within one and five. That's possible. So three. Problem is I have no clue if I'm right. Now for this one, it's really spackly. It's like Antlers Gone Wild. So, Antlers Gone Wild, there is... One. Okay. <laughs> that was really easy. Antlers Gone Wild is a, a one. And then, the snake... With... Wh what would that be? If this is a snake, what what is this? A snake with... I don't know. Maybe it's not a snake. Maybe it's a... Maybe it's half of a TV antenna. Half of a TV antenna! There's one, two. There are two. That's still within one five. Let's see. One and five? Oh, yeah! Okay, so before you guys are really impressed with me for blundering, I will admit, I will admit, I kind of cheated. I looked this one up. I didn't look up the answer. I, I just looked up if we needed to look in the night sky, and wait a minute. Oh, I know how to get this. I know how to get this one. See, there are none over there. So, this is so cool. So, one, two, three, four. There are four. So, let's go. Uh, actually, there are four, and then of the other one, there are one two. So, four, two, four, two, two, four, two, two, one. That's it. Four, two, two, one. That's so cool. But I, I looked that up. I, I looked up a, a, like, one or two hints, like, here. Th this was the thing that got me thinking, just so you guys know. Uh, where is it? The trick to solving is, uh, lies in the number of constellations you count on the wall. And that's that's what I got. Originally I was like, wait, does that mean does that mean I need to look at the stars? Like the number of stars in the constellation? But no. Uh, it's four two two one, I believe. This was a cool shrine! Once again. These none of these are the same. Four two two I ran with it. That's not good. Throw it in there. Four two two one, and open open sesame. Very cool. This was this was a cool shrine, even if it was really difficult. Also, that's a good weapon. That's a really good weapon. A knight's claymore is kind of meh, but it has attack up six, which makes it bonkers. Look at the stats here: forty four. As opposed to, uh, where is it? 55? No, it's 44 with attack up 6. So it's an attack of 50, which is only 5 five less than my ancient uh, blade saw. Okay, that took forever and a day and a half. Let's get another orb. Dear goodness, that took forever and a day. So let's go talk to that guy with the time we have left in this episode and ask him about the, the trials. Hey, buddy. Yes, I, I'm ready. Do it. Help me, help me up, bro. I'll do it. You know, if you keep doing everything everyone asks you without question, you're going to get conned eventually. Anyway, where was I? Oh yeah, the Korok Trials. Short, long story short, you need to visit all the shrines in the Korok Forest so that you can be considered a real grown-up. Uh, trial 1, in the Southwest Forest. Trial of Second Sight. Trial 2, yes. Okay, so, Southwest Forest is where we're going. Hello. You're a different-looking Korok, because you have darker wood. 
Hey, are you the hero? Could it be? Welcome to Korok Forest. You're much, much cooler looking than I thought you'd be. But to be sure you're up to the task at hand, I prepared a trial for you. What do you think? Will you accept my trial? Hooray! Show me a rod with the power of ice, please. You can wave this around, wa rod around to freeze monsters in their track. Ice his robes love to wreak havoc with them. If Mr. Hero were to wield a rod with the power of ice, he would be even stronger. And cooler. Which is something I'm not doing right now. So southwest... I guess I'm going west. I'm not sure if I'm allowed to go anywhere I want now. Because before, it was like, oh man, venturing on your own without the power of the, the torch is bad. And you're bad for thinking that you could get away with such a thing. So, I don't know, well... Oh, boy. It looks like... We're doing more of the same. Here, let me just kind of wander around and see. There's a Korok. Going alone? I don't know. He oh, you! You're Mr. Hero, right? You're gonna do the Korok trial, yes, yes? Sure. I knew it. I'd like to ask you a favor, then. My little Oki just set out to do the Korok trial. Normally I'd go along, too, but Oki insists on going alone. I let Oki go, but well, I'm just getting worried. Could you please follow Oki without being seen? I want to make sure nothing bad happens. Where's Oki? But where, where? Lost pilgrimage, follow Oki without being seen. Where is Oki? Do I just walk for I think I just walk forward. So, this is a stealth mission, which means... I'm all about that stealth. And I will equip my stealth stuff and go about my way. There he is. Here. I, I want to grab these things. I don't. Oh, blue nightshade? Okay. Look at me being all stealthy. Let's die behind this tree. No, you, you hear nothing. In fact,. Sneaky elixir. I'm invisible. <laughs> I'm invisible, Gordy. Just follow around. Follow him around. Show him the power of the juice weasel. He's running, but thankfully, oh, I can barely see him. Thankfully, I'm. I can just jump and be about as fast as he can. Oh, this is. He remembers this tree. I remember this nightshade because it's all mine. You don't hear me. I wonder how I, how close I could get with a high, a high level stealth boost because I'm really close right now. I'm right up in on this. I'm stalking this guy. Imagine if I were an enemy, he'd be dead. He has no clue I'm here because I'm so stealthy. In fact, I can probably go a little bit faster. Look how close I am! I can almost touch the guy. I'm also glad that the game is not using the... Uh, I'm also glad the game isn't using the gamepad microphone, because that would be terrible. There's no chest in there, there's no chest in there. Also, how are they not creeped out by these trees? These trees are about as scary as Pac-Man World 2, which no one has played. I can talk to him from here! Uh. Oh. Oh, it wasn't even me. It was a branch. I'm so stealthy. Where'd that branch even come from? There's nothing above us. Oh, he actually suspects me. I wonder... I wonder if that's represent... That's representing my, my chant... Like, a mistake I just made. Where are you going? What was that? What do you call that maneuver, huh? Is that another stick? I'll take the stick. Oh, yeah, I, I can't. I can't see the shrine from here. I wonder what's in that log. That log looks kind of cool. Yep, yeah, admire the flowers, not me. Also, I think the it's in there. Well, we're going through there nonetheless. I don't see anything else around, so I think I'll follow. Also, now is when I should veer off. I can still see him. Maybe not anymore, but 
I, I'm not going through there. If he turns around, that's not good. So I'll just wait for him here. There's no reason for me to go inside. Okay, he better not see me. Okay, good. Good. Just follow closely, but not too close. I wonder if my sensor's being confused right now, because it's been showing that we're right on top of this thing the entire time. Oh, I, I stood up! A ghost! Wait, you're not a ghost. Were you following me? I said I could do this by myself, and now I'm not by myself. I'll have to do it all over again. You know what this log reminds me of? And by that I mean it's a log, and thus all logs remind me of this. That one portion from Majora's Mask with Skull Kid. Now we're back on the trail. I'm going to follow along with a, a much greater distance. Try to cut through this vegetation rather than follow directly behind him. And no one's there. Because this is a big clearing. What did he... What is he seeing? Did he, he didn't see me. Where is he? There he is. Okay. I was a little bit worried there that he, he just went running off. Yeah, he wasn't scared of me just then. He was just scared in general. I'm not sure if these bushes actually give me cover or not, but I'm not going to risk it. Okay, where are you going? Wait, what? Oh my goodness. Are you kidding me? Oh, there he goes running again. I'm not going to follow too closely. Just close enough where I can see him, and I can barely see him right now. Oh, I can... I can't even see him. Okay, there he is. Okay. I'm just going to flip from tree to tree. Where'd he go? Where is he? Oh, there he is. No! No! <laughs> No! I didn't see him! Ah, <sighs> my goodness. Yeah, you should be scared. I'm gonna kill you when all this is done. There's the wolf. I don't think we should kill the wolf. There he goes to the side. The wolf is gonna leave him alone. Hopefully not bug us. Oh, no. Please don't bother us. Okay. Where'd he go? There he is. Oh, whew. Got the wolf. Now do your thing. Well, this is good. This is further than I've ever gotten. I could get the wolf meat, but... I'd rather another wolf get it. I've come so close. I've gotten so far. Where'd he even go? Where'd he go? Yeah. Oh, there he is. Okay. They blend in so well. I barely see the shot, the moonlight off of his right side. I'll latch onto that. Not get too close. Always hide behind something. Still seeing that shape. There's the shrine. Don't get overzealous, pal. Wait for him to complete his little ritual. I don't even really need to track him anymore. Can't even see him anymore. Oh, no, there he is. Okay. Be careful, this is probably where his, his vision radius is the largest, just because he's elevated. Turned around. He doesn't see anything. Can I come up now? He made it. 
I'm going to discover the shrine first. That way I kind of know where it is. Uh, I fought. Yeah, I made it. I finished the trial. Hello? Who's there? Hey, are you that hero guy? You know, Mr. Hero? Guess what, Mr. Hero? I did the trial all by myself. Aren't I brave? Oh, yeah, you're probably here for the shrine. The great Eiko Tree said that the monk's blessing is waiting in the shrine ahead. Why don't you take a look? Oh, gladly. That was a trial. Dog Chico's blessing. What is it? An ancient. Really? An ancient core? An ancient core? <laughs> Uh, well, you know what? It's it's a spirit orb. That's good, at least. And he's gone. And that's our, our shrine for the episode, or our trial. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode in any capacity, please click like. If you didn't, then drop a comment telling me I can make the next episode so that you would like it. Next time in Breath of the Wild, we are going to be completing yet another trial. I'm hoping this warps me back to the, the clearing. That it does. Wow, that's convenient. Hey, Tasho. You did a great job on the trial. I was cool and composed the whole time. And that's our reward. That's, that's all we get. If you want to go back to the shrine, just follow the flowers. They won't let you down. That's right. If you follow the flowers, you won't get lost. Well, there we go. Next time, we're going to be doing another shrine. I release new episodes of Breath of the Wild every Monday and Wednesday. I'm also less playing Pikmin 2 right now. And new episodes of that are released every Tuesday and Thursday. Next time, we're going to be doing what I've already said twice before. And I'll see you guys then. Or... You would lose both. Found the key. Yeah. Ah, but Pustum. Why? I'm carrying you. Die. Ah. Can pull the master sword, and no one will be bored when we get hurt to the core. Right now. It hurts a lot, but I think we can do it. We did it.